Um, Clay, why don't you go put the stuff in the car and I'll go order. Yeah, that sounds good. So, uh, how's it been so far? So, how have you been? Oh. Mom, you do not have to order. So, what can I get you, fine folks? Hmm? What do you order? Hmm? What do you order? Ma'am, we don't know what you're saying. Come on, what do you order? Do I need to write it down? I am... Um... Ugh! Your mannequins don't understand. Boy, I'm speaking the anger dash. Ugh. Ow! What do you want to order? Oh! What do you want to order? That's what you were trying to say. Yeah. Yes, I was. But you really Americans don't understand. Do you? Hmm? Hmm? No, no. Who? What do you want? Um, two kibbles, one cake, one fish, and a Coke. Okay. You're lucky to have a fun like her. She fast to know what you guys want. How did you know what we wanted? Do you really want to ask that? Yes! Stir, first of all, I heard you want kibble. Then I heard Catherine want fish and Klein want cake. Well, guys, all the luggage is in the car. Uh, who ordered? Jocelyn, then. Okay. One cake. <gasps> you ordered me cake. I wanted cake. <sighs> Do you really want me to explain it? Yes. Okay. Well, first off, I heard you wanted cake. Heard Hono. Hono wanted kibble, and Catherine want fish. Oh, we are very predictable. Yes, yes, you are. Well, um, now that we're all done, let's go. Agreed. Well, I have fun. I had fun. Hey, Hono? Hono! Hono, wait! Hono! Yes? Do you mind if I sleep over here tonight? Oh. oh no. Oh no. Oh no. She'll be fine, lover boy. Oh no, just gets like this when a guy she likes asks her. Oh no, likes me? Oh, uh, maybe we should all just go inside. Sounds good, sounds good. Somebody grab Hono. Like now. Oh, I'll grab her. Can you grab the bags? Yeah. Jeez. I don't know how I get sucked with this.
So, Hona will be okay. Hona will get through this, trust us. It happens a lot. Like, a lot. Oh, well, so she's like multiple guys. No, this just happens in general. Oh! Sorry, guys, if... Oh. Uh, oh, no. Well, she'll be okay. Yeah, she'll be okay. Just get her ready for bed. Okay. We'll put the stuff away. Guys, we left with all the dirty work. Well, it's not dirty work, actually. It's helpful. So, why does he have the rights to come in our house? Hono pays the rent and stuff like that. And she's the only one with the real job. So, uh, yeah. That's better. So, technically, since Hono made the decision for him to be allowed to sleep over, he gets to sleep over. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ugh. That's right. But we have to respect Hono's wishes. And if Hono's wishes is for him to sleep over, Hono's, Hono gets that wish. You have to realize that. Okay. Hono is all ready for bed. Oh, so where can I sleep? I'll give you a tether of my blanket. I got ya. There, you'll get this tether of my blanket. Oh, uh, thank you. No problem. Oh, really? Thank you, Jocelyn. Your real friend. <laughs> yeah, I don't match that. Uh, should I just put Hono in her bed? Uh huh. Oh, she has a fluffy mattress. Of course, Hono does. She lives here. All of you. All of you. Uh huh. Yep. Well, sometimes if we need to. Honestly, this is just one big sleepover. Oh. Well, good night. Already? You're joking, right? You're really not going to bed, are you? Please tell me you're not. Yes, I am. Good night, ladies. Ugh. Well then, good night, everyone. Looks like I had to do this. Well, you, everyone, I hope you enjoyed Hono's sleepover. This was not a series. It was just a fun little show. But when we all go to bed, show's over, so good night. And bye forever.